Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Confession Zone. I'm your girl, Jini Waria. And if you're new to this channel, this show is all about reading other people's confessions. Wanaingianga kwa Instagram yangu and the wanafungua roho. You know, they tell me about their secrets, nini nini. But I make sure that they remain anonymous. And yeah, basically that's it. And if you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much. Na kama hauja subscribe, kindly hit it. Subscribe. Okay, so this one, it's quite a long one. Okay. All families have a family secret, but our family's secret is darker. Okay. When I was 14, my stepdad raped me and he told me not to tell my mom. And since my relationship with my mom was not that tight, I didn't tell her. After several months, my mom noticed that I was pregnant. She bought a pregnancy test to confirm her doubts and the test came positive that I was pregnant. She was in disbelief and she asked me how it happened. I told her that it was my stepdad. She was so mad and she broke up with him. She didn't want to report the matter because she didn't want people to know our business. Uh, they would have judged her as a bad mother. So, mama kanipeleka kwa boat, but huyo doki akakata since I was very young. He said, neza kufia huko. Well, mama kache yo story ya kwa boat, akasema tuhame. Na tukahamia place fulani kitengela huko interior sana. It was like a hideout. But tukua huko, my mom pretended to be pregnant. She used to tell my grandmother and my auntie and and all her friends that she is pregnant. And mimi nilikuwa nashinda kwa nyumba. And the neighbors too thought she was pregnant and they didn't even know that I was pregnant. She would put stuff on her belly to make her appear pregnant. Well, it worked well and she bought and she bought drugs to induce lactation. When I got into labor, I, I didn't go to the hospital. She helped me deliver in the house. And yeah, it was successful. The baby was underweight um, and she left. And she left me in the house and took the baby to the hospital. Wakitoka Hosi, she took birth notification under her name. Basically, the baby became hers. Si kutoka kama nime mnyonyesha hata once hivi. And I was okay with all that. I went back to school, nika repeat class 8, and went ahead with life. And she told me that that's a secret I should die with. Well, everyone believed that that was her baby without any suspicions. Ata mimi mwenyewe huwa naona ni kama brother yangu tu. Now it has been 9 years, he's 9 years, he will be turning 10 years next week. Sometimes your secret when any haunt manze. I just think that my bro deserves to know the truth that he is my son. But then naona ni kimsho, anaweza ona ni kama na cheesy. Anyway, I don't think there is someone who is carrying a huge secret than me. This is crazy, guys. Can you imagine if your sister came up to you and told you, Ati, Manze, there is something that I need to tell you. You are my son. I'm your mother. Unezona ni kama na cheese. Unezona ni kama na pululu. Like, what the hell? Wah! That's mad crazy. Wah! Bro. Moving on to the next one. But Jenny, can you imagine this? My boyfriend has never used his money on me. I pay for our debts. I pay our Uber. There is a time he went to Mombasa and he made me pay flight tickets for the both of us and also every spending I'm the one who catered for. It's so exhausting and it's not like he doesn't have a job. Dude earns better than me by far. Should I leave him or why could he be doing that? Please, I need advice. Hmm, I think you should leave him because he's probably spending his money on another girl. Mm -hmm. Moving on to the next one. Hide my identity, please. My wife picks up calls and scrolls on TikTok while I'm making love to her. I really hate it, but I don't know how to address the matter. She just lays there laughing while she is seeing something funny or talking to her friends on the phone. I really don't know what's wrong with her. Bro, can you imagine? <laughs> okay, guys, can you imagine like somebody, people, hey, 
they are making love and then I could like <laughs> oh my god yeah oh no bro bro anyway that's it for today thank you so much for watching i was your girl jenoria until next time bye bye and please guys subscribe and like this video and leave a comment thank you so much for watching i was your girl jenoria until next time bye bye